Breaking news, countries around the world in shock after watching Russian power plant, the Ukrainian pleas for help, plus rain moving in right now. What about the morning commute? Dallas' forecast in 60 seconds. Shop fresh new arrivals in stock right now during the Mathis Brothers Spring Style event. Whatever your style, at Mathis Brothers, we have the looks you want in stock. Shop rustic farmhouse, timeless classics, fresh and modern, and boho chic styles all at our everyday low prices. And visit our newest location at the Marketplace in Irvine. We have your style in stock now during the Spring Style event at Mathis Brothers. This is Eyewitness News with live breaking news. We begin with breaking news at 11 and a terrifying escalation of hostilities in Ukraine as Russian forces attack the largest nuclear power plant in Europe. Ukraine's president begging the world for help to head off a potential nuclear disaster. That Russian attack starting a fire at the plant and forcing a number of the site's six nuclear reactors to shut down. All of this happening as the humanitarian crisis grows worse by the day. Eyewitness News reporter Christian Cordero joining us live with the late breaking developments right now. Christian. Mark, we just got an update about that nuclear power plant. Shelling started that fire there to some non essential equipment. The fire was just extinguished. It couldn't be put out until the missiles stopped. And according to the AP, Ukrainian officials just now said that the Russian military has taken control of that site. There have been so many pleas tonight to stop firing missiles near Europe's largest nuclear plant, as doing so brings this attack into new territory.